Good morning from the beautiful Grand Floridian Resort. And welcome to the Pretty Cool Vlog, where we show you things that we think are pretty cool. Today we are going to venture into the Magic Kingdom, and it's going to be a busy day. This is the final Sunday of the Christmas season. Tomorrow's Monday, so it starts just regular back old normal life. It's going to be crazy, I think, anyways. Pretty sure it is. But first, we're going to get some breakfast here at the Grand Floridian Cafe. Alright, so our table wasn't quite ready yet. So we've decided to come down here into the grand room where you can see they still got that giant beautiful Christmas tree up in the center here. The, the old gingerbread house that was right in this general area, that one is gone. But we're just going to mosey around and just kind of browse around a bit and take a few pictures and stuff and just enjoy this a little bit uh, until our table's ready. And the design in here is definitely grand. It's a good name for the place. Grand Floridian. just can't stop looking at this thing. It is pretty grand. Now what have we here? What do you think goes on this table? I mean this is the grand ballroom. Do you think do you think this could be for the grand ball? Alright so our table's ready. So we're walking in an old Grand Floridian Cafe here. That's pretty busy. Not too bad but still got that Christmas up so that's pretty cool. Ooh, and we got a nice window view. That's nice. That's always nice to get a Get a seat by the window. Ooh, there's a monorail. Did we catch it? Oh, a little bit of it. Anyways, well, we got our food. It came out. Not this flower, although that flower is very pretty. But Jessica, of course, she got this equally beautiful looking Bloody Mary. Look at that. I got my French uh, press crop coffee. JR got a uh, pretty awesome looking smoothie, smoothie over there. Berry. It's a berry, berry awesome looking. Time to do the. Ooh, you know what? Watch this. And along with our drinks, we did get this yogurt parfait plate that looks actually really good. It's got bananas, pineapples, cantaloupe, some uh, melon, oats, raspberry. That's going to be like a Fig Newton right there, I think. I'll eat that. All right, so we finished up at Old Grand Floridian Cafe, heading on up to the monorail. And in just a moment, we'll be stepping in to that magic kingdom. Oh, yep. Hey, look, we're in the old magic kingdom. It is busy, but it's really not as busy as I thought it was going to be, and the Christmas is still up, so let's make sure and look at that stuff. Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! And look at it! Look at this sea! It is, it is pretty crowded. That is a sea of people out there, but it is beautiful. Everybody looks happy, so you know what? Good stuff. Good stuff. Practically perfect. <laughs> you know what else is practically perfect? On a Christmas day, the Haunted Mansion. And it's a good thing we got a fast pass because holy moly, that line, that standby line is way back there. Oh, not much Christmassy about this place here. No, I don't have a good feeling about this. Well, that was fun taking a nice little tour of those happy haunts in the old Haunted Mansion. Oh. Rule breakers. Coming here through old Fantasyland, not new Fantasyland, but old Fantasyland. The uh, crowds really aren't too terrible, I gotta say. We expected much heavier crowds than this right here, although if you really look down in there, that is a sea of people. Okay, 110 for Peter Pan. That's a good indication of a busy day. Fast pass entrance, the line is going back. So even if you have a fast pass, it is, you are gonna sit in line for just a little bit. Just because that's a beautiful shot there, we'll, we'll just, as we pass by all of these people. I just take a look at that, because like I said, it does look neat. Ooh, you can see the nets are still up. Elsa's Christmas lights are still up, up there. But right now, I think we're gonna head over to Space Mountain, head to the future Tomorrowland. Not too far in the future, just tomorrow. I wanna see if the Christmas overlay is still up. It might be, that'd be pretty cool if it is. Not, that's okay, we've missed it this year, but we've got a fast pass, so we're gonna use it. All right, so we are walking into Space Mountain. We're gonna see if this thing has the holiday overlay still, fingers crossed, I'm really hoping. I do want to see it. If not, it'll still be fun. 
We'll have to wait till next year. All right, so Space Mountain was pretty cool. You know, as always, we appreciate you, Tomorrowland. We'll be back another time, not tomorrow, sometime in the future. We are going to take one more look down at the uh, main street so we can see a little bit of that Christmas stuff uh, just before it gets put away for another few months. All right, let's go take one last look. There's those main street Christmas decorations. One last look at those things. It is funny that the Move It Shake It parade is going on. Every time we we're gonna leave, that thing is slowing us down. Well, we stepped into one of these little uptown fancy shops because Jessica wants to get a, a new wallet. Nice fancy wallet, but looky here they have their uh, they got their Christmas store hanging in here as well. Well guys, we came here to see the last bit of these Christmas decorations for 2019, it's 2020 now, but it is the 2019 Christmas season and this is the end of it. Guys, thanks for coming along once again on our adventures into Disney. We came through looking to see how the crowds were. We thought it was going to be crazy, but it really wasn't. We got to ride a couple of rides. The lines were a little bit longer than usual, so expect that if you come during this time of the year. If you're interested in any of the gear that we use, I'll put that in the description below with links to everything that we use just in case for those people who are interested. All right, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more of these antics all around. We do Disney, we do food, we do a little bit of travel, attractions and things. Not always Disney, but it is Disney heavy. But in any case, we appreciate you guys coming along and we'll see you guys in the next one. As far as we're concerned, that's pretty cool.